Hey there, everyone. Did you miss me? Oh my God. Let me kind of change the shape of my hat. Lord Jesus. Oh, it's so nice to see the little children again. Y'all need to gather around. Oh my goodness. I'm going to read a book of poetry because I'm Sister Georgie from Mississippi by way of Jamaica, West Indies. Yes. And like I said, it's Women's Month, so uh, the month of March. So we're going to be reading stories of women authors, uh, uh, people about women, women uh, who have who have their stories written about them and also women authors. And guess what? Sister Georgie, okay, my, uh, my author person is Apostle Faith Walters, okay? And... She wrote a book. Yes, yes. You see her picture on the front. Okay, Sister Georgia is the other character, but Apostle Faith Walters wrote the book. Okay, her picture on the back. Okay, and this book is a book, Poems About Myself, S.T. Yes, I'm just going to read you two stories from the book, because the book is on sale. You can't really pick this up at the library, but you can pick it up on Amazon.com. Okay, I have it on sale. Okay, and you can go to my website at wamoe.org and get the book, and you get to read these uh these little poetry, and it will help you. So you ask your mommy and daddy if you get a copy of this book from my website. Okay, so I'm gonna read just a couple of them. I'm gonna read uh 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 um uh. No, page 15. Actually, I'm going to change from page 15. I'm going to read page 21. Maybe I'll read page 15. Okay. And 21 and 27. Okay. Let me read 21. I like 21. Okay. And I'm reading some excerpts from my book. I don't want to read too much. Okay. And it's poems about my self-esteem. This design was designed by my daughter. Okay, she likes she she's an artist, so she likes to uh, design certain things. So this book is, of course, by Apostle Faith Walters. Okay, and page twenty one says mirror image. When I look in the mirror, I see me. I see me. I see me looking back at me. Oh my goodness, it's some deepness. Oh my God. When I look in the mirror, yes, I see me. I see me. I see me looking back at me. You know what that means? You're looking at yourself. You see yourself how beautiful you are because you're fearfully and wonderfully made. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes. And I'm going to read another one on page 27. He says, there is greatness in me. There is greatness in me, and I know it's there. I can educate my mind to be sincere. I can change my life to reach a new level. Yes, I know there is greatness in me. I'm just going to leave it at that for these two, these two porches because I want you to get the book. Okay, you can find this book on Amazon.com or you go to my website. You can also connect to Amazon at my website, W-A-M-O-E.org, okay, O-R-G, okay, and it's poems about my self-esteem. And that last poem read in page 21 says, greatness in you. Yes, yes, yes. Know that there is, you are so much, you are so powerful. You must never, ever think of yourself not having power. You can change uh, your community. You can change a society. Yes, yes, you can change. You have to have that mindset to want to do uh, uh, something that could better your life. And let me tell you something. You want to wait till you get older to get a hobby. Do something. Sit and write. You know, write little story. It don't matter how you can't spell it so well. Just keep writing. Whatever come to your mind, write, draw, sing, play the piano, find an instrument, 
get caught up in something and be very good at it. And the more you work at it, is the more the better you become. And you do it from a little girl and a little boy. So you're not too young to learn something. All right. So I want you to understand that you are powerful. You are smart. You got it going on. And you got to tell yourself that there is greatness in me. And remember when I say you look at the mirror, you look at yourself and realize <coughs> there is greatness in you. Okay. So little children, little boys and little girls, don't you give up on your life. Sister Georgie says, don't give up on your life. Oh my goodness. You want to say hello? Say hello. Oh my goodness. He like to come around when I, I'm trying to talk. Okay. This is Ray Ray. Okay. Ray Ray, say hello to the people. Say hello. Say hello. See, now he trying to get all funny now. You always got to come up in my business and then he going to try to act like he didn't want to be a part of it. Okay. Go on about your business. Yes. Next time we'll come around here. See now, see what he does, you know? So anyway, you know, I want you to remember that you are loved, you know, and you know, you make a difference and be nice to your brother, be nice to your sister. And when you go to school, be nice to your classmates. Don't be mean. Okay. Don't be a bully. Don't be hurting uh, little boys and little girls and say mean things to them. Come on now. Sister Georgie don't like that. No, 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 no. Uh-uh. Sister Georgie don't like when children make say mean things to other children. It's not nice. Okay. And Jesus don't love that either. Okay. So I want you to be good little boys and girls in your, in your home, in your community. And when you go to school, be kind. You see a student sitting by themselves, you know, and make up, have a conversation. Ask if you can sit with them and, you know, if you can be their friend and talk to them. Don't let them be lonely and let other people come and bother them. Okay. Sister Georgie, always be a good leader. Good leader, you don't be a follower. You be a good leader. You lead people in the right direction. Don't lead people astray. You could be a little person and lead people by doing the right thing. And you you set a good example for, for people around you. And they look up to you because they see you. And it don't matter if people want to make fun of you and call you the, the teacher's pet or you're good at two or you think you're this or you think you're that. It's all right. Just don't be discouraged, little boy, little, little boys and little girls. Keep doing the right thing. Okay, because little by little, see, sometimes people make it fun of you. Guess what? They want to do it and don't know how to do it. And you're doing and you're doing you're doing so good at it. You keep your head up. And let me tell you something. If they want to say mean things to you. Yes. Remember it happened to Venus. I read that uh, Serena in her time when they were making fun of her because she was winning all those trophies, but she didn't give up. Yeah, sometimes she cried. You cry at home and you tell your parents what was going on and, you know, tell the teacher or whatever it is, but you know, don't give up. Don't stop being a good boy and good girl that you are. Okay. And don't let people influence you negatively. And please children love yourself so much that you don't want to take your life. And these little children doing things to themselves, which is not a good thing. Okay. So please love you and take care of you. Okay. And know that I love you and Jesus loves you more. So don't forget to connect to Wamo Media. Okay. And we are on the YouTube uh, channel at Wamo Ministries at gmail.com and go to Wamo Media, W-A-M-O-E, O R G. Thank you so much and see you next time. This is Sister Georgie. Enjoy your evening. Enjoy your day. Enjoy your night because I don't know which part of the world y'all listen to this from. So, you know, my night could be your morning or your afternoon. Okay. So, have a great day. So, see you next time. This is Sister Georgie saying goodbye. Ooh.
my God.